I write as a Reformed theologian in the, the broader Christian tradition, and particularly in the Reformed world since the early 20th century, because of the influence of people like Kuiper and Bavinck and what we refer to as the Kuiperian or Neo-Calvinist tradition, there's been a great emphasis on this world in every sphere being a, a place where God's glory uh, can be sought and God's goodness can be seen. And that's a wonderful truth, the idea that uh, there's not one square inch of this world that is not Jesus Christ's and over which he doesn't claim it as Lord. And, and we could go further. There's not one nook and cranny of ourselves that isn't his as well. And so that uh, overcoming of secularism in one sense is profoundly important. However, particularly in, in later Kuyperian and Neo-Calvinist thought, this can oftentimes be taken in a way that's very oppositional to the, the classical, spiritual, mystical emphases of women and men who through the centuries have sought the beatific vision, communion with God, uh, and sometimes out of a fear of pietism with some of its excesses or of a fear of individualism and a, an idea that that might somehow lead us away from social responsibilities. There's been a real allergy and even at times a mockery of that kind of classical eschatology, writing it off as Platonism or as going Greek, uh, of singing lies in church, as some have said. Uh, again, the, the issue isn't to somehow combat the idea that we do attest the resurrection of the body, that we do look forward to the new heavens and the new earth, but that the greatest glory presented there in the vision of Revelation is that God dwells there. Uh, that he himself will be with us, that Jesus Christ says, I am coming soon, behold. And so to lose that personal, uh, communion-focused, theocentric vision is actually to, to miss the main point, to realize that the other gifts are signs that point us to the, the blessedness of God. And so it's, it's a desire to more deeply root and uh, more hopefully, more helpfully frame that kind of neo-Calvinist uh, corrective itself.